have really put in a lot of the effort for organizing these events, especially north of the city. We'd like to thank the Neda Peace for Iran group. The international supporters of this event today are Shirin Abadi, Iranian TV Canada, Iran Star, Kurdish House, Labor Star Canada, McMaster Iranian Students Association, Multiple Voices for Change, Muslim Canadian Congress, Pasargat TV, Pan Canada, Right and Democracy for Iran, Salam Toronto, Shahran Publications, Shahrait of the Committee for Solidarity with Iran, Solidarity. <laughs> با سلام به هموطنان عزیز و با همدلی و همبستگی با با همدلی و همبستگی با زندانیان سیاسی در ایران اگه ایزه بفرمایید من صحبت هم به انگلیسی میکنم که همه متوجه بشن I'm happy to join with you today in what will remain in our memory and in the memory of many Canadians as a great demonstration of freedom in Iran and solidarity with the Iranian quest for democracy. Iranian quest for democracy needs your solidarity and your encouragement. Encouragement is like oxygen for the soul. Iranians need the world just as the world needs Iranians. And so we've come here today to ask for unity and solidarity. Solidarity is not a matter of sentiment. It's about responsibility. We are morally responsible for what is happening today in Iran. If Canada wants to be a great nation, it needs to be a responsible nation. Canada needs to be a nation that continues to care about the suffering of others. So we've gathered here today to express our anger, our grief, and our deep concern over the recent violations of now it is the time to make real the promises of the we are here to remember Maziar Bahari a fellow Iranian Canadian journalist we are here to remember Kian Taj Bakhsh an Iranian Cana American scholar we are here to remember Shadi Saad an Iranian women's rights activist and journalist who have been detained illegally but these are only three symbolic names among 3,000 individuals arrested and imprisoned recently in Iran. Our future is bound to their freedom. Our destiny is tied up with their destiny. We cannot be satisfied as long as our fellow citizens are in jail. We are not satisfied and we will not be satisfied until justice rolls down like mighty water and righteousness grows like an ever-flowing stream in Iran. ...of 2009 who injected...